Hi, Zach here, and as you can see, we're playing some Don't Starve. Not Don't Starve together, just regular Don't Starve, and prepare to watch me die a lot. Because I only have, um, when I only have, um, Wilson right now. Might as well, just in case I don't die. Don't get too excited, because I'm going to die. So my preferable base is, like, close enough to the beefaloes where they're in mating season, they're not a big deal. But, um, far enough from them when they are, they aren't a big deal. And close, pretty, fairly close to picking, or at least, like, a good, like, a fair amount away from the picking. So I don't want to, like, die a bunch. Because I only have a maximum of watch that can technically have infinite, but... That's late game stuff, and I am on day one, and it's gonna take forever to load. Whew, lovely stuff that is. Say, pal, you don't look so good. Yeah, you're telling me, dude. <coughs> I forget what season it starts in. And by forget, I mean I don't know. But as you can see, I mean, it's going to be a lot of boring stuff early game because, well, it's a lot of boring stuff early game. Oh, wow. That's actually pretty good. That's actually really good. <coughs> for early, well, not for early game. That's like a, that's a second chance, dude. That's a second chance right there. Usually I go to that worm. I'd usually go to that wormhole. But, um... But there's this road, and it leads to usually a pig village, or every once in a while, Chester's um key. For some reason, a lot of people don't like Chester, which is really idiotic in my opinion, because he may not be the fastest thing, but he can still like hold all the non-necessity items that you want to keep for like base expansion. Like he's pretty, he's a really good guy. Like, he's pretty much a backpack. He's a backpack. That's what he is. But as you go, oh, beefalo, sweet. So at least I know they're going to be right there-ish. <coughs> and if you guys are wondering, I'm still dealing with allergies. They've just gotten better a little bit. Anyways. But as we continue going through, ooh, ooh. Who knows, we might find Glomer statue here. Because, you know, he gives you pretty much um, some good... What what, you, what would you call that? Uh, good fertilizer and fuel. Or fires. And stuff. But as you can see, we're in here in this biome. I'm not sure what it's called, because I... The birch nut biome is what I'm going to call it. Ooh, and does this lead to... Yep, it appears to... Ooh, at least the pig king. Okay. I was not expecting to get two of the things that I really wanted right off the bat. I'm going to tell you that right now. Wasn't really even expecting that. <coughs> kind of catching me off guard here. Well, that's kind of crazy. Like, kind of, I mean, that's really crazy. Which kind of just blows my mind, okay? I didn't mean for that, but I get, like, a perfect spawn that I want, essentially. I'm also really close to Glomer, too. And some pig houses that I can smash down if I need, if need, if need be. Because, you know, I might need to. To relocate them, probably is what I would do. If I was going to smash down a pickaxe, it'd be to relocate them. <coughs> and there seems to be a, a, an abundance of berries in this area. So I won't starve completely. Ah, look, there's a the glomer statue, too. Wow. Like. Wow. I mean. Wow. Probably gonna set up camp like, oh, yeah, I'll set up camp like right around there, like next to the road. Kind of crazy that I got that, like, just that beautiful start. <coughs> right off the bat. <coughs> and then we go in here. And there's a bunch of pig houses here, too, which is nice. Around the pig king. So, yeah, there's that also. And yeah, we're pretty much set. 
like I got my favorite place. We also have like an extra an extra life too for the time being, unless I die. Because you know that's probably gonna happen. Don't starve dying a lot. That's what I'll probably actually name this series. Cause I'm not I'm not the best at this game. I'm not going to lie to you guys. I'm pretty fucking shitty. I'm pretty shitty. Okay. It's probably gonna be 15, 20 minute episode maximum. I'm not in the mood to like stick around the whole long time. I would kind of like to get this done with, but you know, I, I enjoy starting new series because you know they're very nice to start up. But as you can see here, we um we're starting some good shit. As you can, if you wonder what I'm doing right now, I'm just exploring to make sure that there isn't like anything good. That and I need flint to cut down a tree to create a fire. And you know, I'm not gonna die in day one. Don't worry about it. I, I'm just waiting now. Ooh. Don't need a crate. A pickaxe, that's good. <coughs> I still would like an axe. If you're wondering, yeah, I can make that. And I might as well. Because, you know, hammers are always good to have because they're really, really useful in this game. They made hammers extremely useful in this game. Yeah, I'm just wondering why all the rabbit holes are collapsed. That's like not something I'm used to. Okay. Well, I guess thanks, Wilson. Kingdom of the Bunny Men is closed for this season. I would still appreciate to know what season I'm in, considering I I'm not sure exactly. Uh, I love not getting flint. It's my favorite thing in the world. Usually it only happens on Don't Starve, but you know, no, Don't Starve Together. But you know, looks like we're getting a special one this time, guys. Special. Don't Starve episode. Boom. If you're wondering what I'm doing, I'm making it so I don't waste my torch all the way. Huh. I don't remember that's there. Gotta save the resources early on, you know what I mean? You know, it's my luck, I'm gonna freeze to death in the middle of the night. Cause you know, why not? So that I don't have to um, waste my torch and I can still see from a pretty good area. I also don't have a chance of dying from what's her face, Charlie. Because, you know, that, that's not a good thing to do. I have a pretty good start. I'd prefer not to, um, waste a set start. See? Okay, see, it's not like a huge wormhole, but it got me to this area, and you know, they, they're just like, you know, I can see he's having a hard time right now, but you know, let's fuck him up some more. Nope. <coughs> and that is why I, I, I went. A long time with just one torch there, which is good because that's a singular torch and I didn't have to waste a whole lot on it. But you know, we're just gonna collect all these rocks and stuff 
because we're gonna need them for science scientific ooh you telling me that this is not ooh that might have actually been a really good wormhole then not the best wormhole but you know a pretty good one a pretty darn tootin good one and if you're wondering yes we are playing with Rain of Giants because it's not very fun without it. I mean, you guys, if you guys have ever played the game or watched anyone else play the game, you probably knew that because, you know, that's what happens. Fuck that tall bird over there. It's gonna kill itself for all I care. I'm gonna stop saying that because that's fucked up. Bring me. If it would kill itself, I, I would not, um, I would not object because I, I could use the meat. I could use the meat. Yummy, yummy meat. <coughs> Here's a swamp. Let's see there if there's our if there's some more merm folk down here. They're gonna fight with a tentacle. Maybe they're gonna die. The tentacle's gonna die. You know, I wouldn't mind a tentacle spike early on. They're pretty good for weapons. But it doesn't appear to be a really big swamp. And the rain sucks. I hate you, rain. I hate you. Is that a flower that I'm gonna pick so I don't go completely and totally insane? Yep, it was. Well, this leads to a big village. So we have a big village down here. <coughs> it's probably good. I'll probably relocate these homes up top to the big team. Why not? They have, do have quite a few of them too. Like the biome where um, all the rocks are, but there's just a shikaka ton of spiders, and so I can't really go up there and do anything about it because it'll, or else it'll mess me up real bad, real bad. It's not gonna be dark soon, okay, Wilson? If it was gonna be dark soon, oh my bad. And we're gonna, of course, mine these boulders, so we're gonna need the gold. I mean, if we found a trinket, we'd probably get a bunch of gold, but we're not gonna get a trinket. Or, because we're gonna need these gold, these, um, rocks. Anyways, because we're gonna need a lot of stuff. So I have 12. I'm gonna need, I, I need a 16 to be precise right now. For, um, for purposes that I forget right now. Ooh. I've been having a hard time with my mentality for some reason. It's just been bothering me really badly. But one thing that I I was told today was that the one thing good thing I have is my mic, because my computer's not the best, <coughs> and my recording software. No offense, Elgato. I love your product. It's just not the best, because there can always be something better. Okay, I'm gonna head back up to the pickiness area while I'm gonna set up camp. Because safety, that's why. And by safety I mean it's probably a good play it's probably a good thing to have a nice place set up. Oh, fuck yourself, spiders. You know, I don't like spiders. Spiders can go kill themselves for all I can. Oh no. Oh, I have to get around this mess. This mess. This is going to be fun playing out in later, when I, in later game. Real fun. Forget what the green ones does, so I'm not going to eat it, because that's dangerous. <coughs> that's a dangerous game that I'm not going to play. That is dangerous. Here I push forward. I'm grabbing green mushrooms on the way. If you're wondering, A, why don't you dig them up with a shovel? First of all, I don't have a shovel. Second of all, I don't mind them regrowing. A lot of people are like, yeah, just pick them up, man. It's not like the chances of them regrowing are slim. Very slim. And I'm like, eh. There's still a chance, though. You can't say that there isn't. And if you do, you're lying. You're lying. Oh, look where the Chester Bone is. Sweet. 
Hey Chester, how you doing, dude? If you see, like see a lot of new players like play this game, you'll see them. They'll see Chester and they'll just start attacking him. They'll go berserk on him, and I'm like, whoa, that's Chester, man. Chester is our friend. <coughs> Don't you know? Like, why do you have to be so mean to him? All I wanted to do was um carry your stuff. Like, look, I was gonna store those in them, and he's gonna be like, yeah, thanks, man. Store some of these and that. And... Ooh, ooh, I'm not sure. That's that's good. This went the wrong way for the the, the flint, then I guess. Fuck yourself, Charlie. No, actually, it's it's um. What's his face? Maxwell. This time. Charlie's and Don't Starve together. Oh. Gotta get that um cold effect gone. Oh yeah, I better not have like that effect. Wow, that shit's burning. I'm gonna make a new torch anyways. <coughs> so I can really have this one up. So I can see where I'm going. That's a good thing I have a second. Huh. Wilson. We'll probably end up to where I'm probably gonna set up camp. Don't expect too much from me, guys. I'm probably gonna die soon, very soon, because because I'm bad. Okay, bad. Okay. I'm probably gonna set up. I don't like ponds. Frogs can go along and kill themselves for all I care. I'm sorry, frogs. I just I don't really like you at all. But you know, this episode's probably gonna come to an end soon. Gotta make them nice and easy for me. And then you, so you guys can enjoy them. If you do enjoy my stuff. I don't know if you enjoy my stuff. But you know, I can help, can't I? <coughs> Time to chop down some trees and you're all going crazy. Crazy. And as you should know, giants don't spawn in the first three days. But, um, true guardians do. If you've played this game, like, uh, it be, those are pretty interesting facts. There you go, buddy. Well, I'm just gonna look around and see if I can find a few flowers to pick them out and head off at the end of this episode. With me getting some flowers. <coughs> and exploring this biome a little bit. But it would appear that I'm coming to an end. Just give me a second though. I'm almost done. Ooh. Ooh. We're coming close, guys. We're coming close. Ooh. Well, I'm probably gonna call this, this here, guys. We can go up to my to my um no, oh, there's a gold rock there. My camp, and I'll, I'll, I guess I'll just give me a second. I'll, I'll do the outro when I get there, okay? Well, guys, I enjoyed having you. But I guess I'll see you all.